What it do, YouTube? It's your boy, the Mad Hatter, and today I'm bringing you another NCAA Football 13 online ranked match. Uh, I probably don't need to say that every time. It's pretty obvious what I'm bringing you. It's in the title of the video, but you know what? I'll say it anyway. It keeps it official. All right, so my opponent went with the Texas Longhorns while I went with the Iowa Hawkeyes. This guy had a pretty good record. It was, uh, I think, 199 and 71. I don't know. You can rewind it and check what it was. It was pretty good, though. Definitely not a chump or a bum. So I went into this game thinking it'd be a good game. And I went with Iowa just because they, they have a solid team year after year. And I'd never used them this year so far, so I thought I'd give them a shot. But uh, what I want to talk about mainly in this video is disconnecting. Last night, I was playing this game. I was in a party with CJC Sports and uh, Cole, and uh, man, you, you can ask him. I probably got DC'd five or six times in this one night. I didn't finish one game. EA really needs to fix this because it's really a pain in the ass. If you go into a game, you can't even expect to like play an entire game. It's hard to get a gameplay for you guys, but... I do my best, and this is the best I was able to come up with last night, so I hope you guys enjoy. But, yeah, getting back to um, being DC'd all the time, that is so frustrating. As you see here, I am dumb and throw a pick into his fag D, but it's all good. We come back from this. Don't worry about it. But, yeah, EA really needs to fix the DC glitch and all their disconnect glitches that they have going on. Hopefully, Madden 13 will... Uh, work out the kinks and we will be able to play a glitch free game I know that's a dream but you know it might happen one of these days eventually Matt if it's not Madden 13 hopefully it'll be Madden 14 but uh yeah so to get to the gameplay this guy picks up a third and 19 I can't believe he got that my player just missed a swap but that's what I get for using Iowa but you know they actually turned out to be pretty good I'll be using them again I think so but uh, if you guys want to see any teams just leave in the comments below what teams you'd like to see I like to play with a plethora of teams yeah that's right I use the word plethora but uh, nah yeah I I'll run with almost any team in the game I think I think it's fun to use different teams that you haven't used before and give them a shot and see see what their players can do for you but uh yeah, I have that tight end wide open, try to lead pass inside, my quarterback throws it outside for some reason. This time it works out, do the exact same play, get in the end zone for a touchdown. Go for two, because like I said, I I was pissed off, man. I was DCing, I got DC'd six or seven times in this one night, so fuck it, I'm going for two, you know? I'm trying to beat these kids as bad as I fucking can in the time that they'll play me. But uh, to get to the game... He's just he, he had a nice offense. It took me a while to figure it out, but once I figured it out, I locked it down. But as you can see, he's running this cluster, which a lot of people are running. It's real hard to stop because it has that isolated receiver over there, and it also has the cluster. I, I mean, that's what the formation is named for. Get off me, son. You can't stop this. Got the fader out on lock. Running the counter, this wing offset weak scheme. You guys can check that out. It's dirty, man. It's, what, it's my offense. So, uh, I get to fourth and two and I am this is dumb I uh I'm just sitting in the pocket he ran fag D all game I roll out of the pocket B looks pretty open right not so he wasn't open I guess not open enough so I turn it over on downs and now I seriously got to stop him because I don't want to have him make it a two possession game even though I get ball at halftime I really hate being down two possessions just freaks me out and I feel like I can't run the ball anymore but here he gets a nice spectacular catch animation and I, I thought I was going to strip him right there. I got pretty hype about that but I don't get the ball to come out and he just runs with David Ash. Man, screw David Ash. He's not that fast. He's a white quarterback. <laughs> but uh, nah, he, he was moving the ball pretty well. Uh, respect to this guy. He had a nice little scheme. As you can see that slant was killing me or slant or drag or whatever he was running. But here is where I really start to figure out his defense and start to figure out how to stop him also. So uh, there I get a nice user catch on the fade route. I mean, you can't stop it. No one can. So uh, I just, I'm taking what the defense is giving me right now. I'm waiting for my receivers to come open in between all his fag D and coverage. So there I run the draw because I thought he'd run fag D. The, the best defense in this game is your offensive line. They, I mean, you run into them, you're done. Y your acceleration is gone. But there, I get a touchdown, go for two, hit the fade route, and I'm only down one possession now. I should have picked that off. For some reason, I didn't get... I hit Y, but I didn't get any animation. Here we go. I'm on that now. He's not getting that again. 
Here he tries it one more time and wait for it, wait for it. User! You can't, I mean, I'm, I'm getting this user down. Just like Master Chappie said, this user, I think the secret to it is not sprinting because when you're holding the right trigger or the R2 button, I don't seem to get any SWAT animations or interception animations, but when I'm not sprinting, I get a, way more interceptions and way more SWATs. So, oh, oh, that was nasty. Wait, let's see that one more time. Let's see it. Oh, cut it off. Damn, that was a sexy animation. I wish I would have broken that tackle. I would have been gone for six. But, you know, it's straight. We got this wing offset week. We're going to town. Sexy spin move right there. But, uh, run the screen. Man, this some nice looking offense right here <laughs> if I do say so myself but nah, um yeah I just man DCers really frustrate me but I get hit the curl route and uh he run commits middle I'm screwed but he I don't think he'll do it twice in a row so I just run the ball again and then I'm expecting run commit actually so I go for the pass but it's all good he doesn't run commit but I still get in the end zone somehow I'm thankful for that and uh just I get the ball back after halftime, so that was huge. So now I can take a lead for the first time in this game. I, man, I didn't read my blocks right there. I should have had a touchdown, but uh, get the rocket catch. I don't know if it's really a rocket catch or a spectacular catch, whatever you want to call it. It's nice and it works. One-on-one -on -one coverage, you cannot stop the fade route. I'm telling you. But right here is where it all falls apart. I start to stop this guy's offense, and guess what he's gonna do to me, guys? What? else would someone do online when it's so easy to DC I think I don't know man whatever he was only down one possession he kneels it here for some reason I mean I know he's gonna DC me and here it comes he DCs but you know I was able to record it it was a pretty good gameplay it was a close game so uh, I appreciate appreciate you guys watching and uh, remember to rate comment and subscribe and uh, have a good day boys